The Ford Edge has always been a little bit of a wallflower. Competent, capable, and also a decent seller. 142, 603 units in 2017, in quite simply has didn't generate much raw enthusiasm. Ford tried to alter that perception when it plopped a version of their feisty 315 horse EcoBoost 2. 7 liter V6 beneath the hood from the second gen Edge Sport, we appreciated the extra thrust, but never did we think about the Edge a candidate to the automaker's full ST treatment. However, who could afford predicted a show about sweaty guys making knives will be a hit. It's tempting to dismiss the 2019 Ford Edge Street, which replaces the sport model inside the lineup, like a crass plan to ascribe some hard-earned ST credibility for an otherwise civilian model. Ford has assured us the Edge ST was, actually, developed using the Ford Performance team, which possibilities of upgrades appear to confirm. Power Play Kicking from the makeover is that the installation of the 335 horsepower version from the twin turbo 2. 7 liter V6, still with EcoBoost branding. With 380 pounds to foot of torque, it outguns the outgoing 2. 7 by 20 horsepower and 30 pounds to foot likewise, a typical 8 speed automatic transmission replaces the 6 speed automatic inside the outgoing Edge Sport. Both should help propel the new Edge ST to 60 miles per hour quicker compared to the 5. 6 seconds we've recorded inside the Edge Sport. All wheel drive is standard, and an ST tuned suspension is fitted for sharper responses and improved handling, Ford said. Along with the hardware swamps, the Edge ST features a particular sport mode that tightens throttle response and alter shift programming, including a chance to perform rev matched downshifts and hold gears close to the engine's red line. Selected by depressing the middle button from the new console mounted rotary shifter, sport mode also pre-selects gears for sprightly corner exits, which should enable the driver to brake hard and dive deep into your corner at speed and exit inside a lower gear, keeping engine RPM inside the meat from the power band. Optionally, drivers can call out their very own shifts via the wheel mounted shift paddles. Sport mode also provides greater engine braking and also a slightly more aggressive exhaust note. Also, yes, everything describes a Ford Edge. Ford said the team that developed the ST entered the project with specific grip, braking, ride, and handling targets tailored for enthusiasts. As evidence, think about the Edge ST's relaxed stability control in sport mode, which widens the window regarding wheel spin and slip angle before it steps into 8. Ford told us. Shutting from the stability control completely is really a misnomer, because it leaves the internal system active to assist prevent a rollover, an aspect we will dig. As the Edge ST gets standard 20-inch rolling stock, 21-inch wheels with summer performance tires can be found. A performance braking upgrade is likewise upon the options list. Along with swathing the calipers in red paint, the extra cost binders swap in larger. 13. 6 inch rotors inside the rear and signed the quest for increased bite and thermal capability. Technology Prime. The regular edge is likewise refreshed to the 2019 model year, getting new fascia elements in addition to a new lift gate, rear bumper, and illumination. SD specific appearance cues include a large mesh grille, side skirts, and dual exhaust outlets. Inside, more aggressively bolstered front seats join an SD logo upon the wheel, seat backs, and sill plates. The 2019 Edge ST shares inside the standard 2019 Edge's bounty of standard and optional tech, safety, and driver assist features. The Edge ST is definitely an intriguing proposition, one which wasn't also a blip on our radar until now, so we do wonder exactly who buy it. Price, in fact will determine in which the Edge ST lands upon the short collection of non-premium performance midsize crossovers and SUVs. Currently, the Jeep Grand Cherokee and Dodge Durango SRT models start above $64, oh, oh, when the Edge ST is available and for significantly less, it might find a little but devoted audience. First, however, we have to get behind the wheel to work out if it's worthy from the ST suffix.